To make this intro, I used motion. So you first want to open it up. So then, see there are all these different uh, compositions. And if you, only, uh, if you only have a few, well then you need to download some more by going up to the Apple menu and software update and there you'll find some more effects that you'll be able to download for free. So I use decode and you can see that one. You can see what that one looks like. And so I'm going to choose this one. Okay, this is it. This is motion. So you want to do shift Z. Never forget shift Z. Always do that when you open motion. First thing you do. So I'm going to open up titles and I'm going to move that over to where the title appears. Then you select the one you want to do first. And then don't do it from there because it's going to crash. Instead, click on the inspector. And then scroll down, and then type in whatever you want to do. So I'm going to type in Apple News, because my blog is called Apple News. Then we're going to do subtitle, and I'm going to write by the Apple Man. So, by the Apple man so next all you gotta do is go up to share the share menu and then once you click that go to export movie and then once it opens up it'll say current settings and you want to change that to h2 h.264 because it's going to take up too much space because that is the default format and takes up a lot of space. So then I'm going to open it up with QuickTime Player. And I want to include video and audio. Well, there's no audio, but if there was, that would be a good thing. So I'm going to put it on my desktop and I'm going to call it Intro. And then you just push Save and wait for it to render.